<laughs> and so, but I think it's easy to be that armchair quarterback to sit mm-hmm. in mm-hmm. the pew or in the chair. And, oh, they messed up. They didn't, yeah. they, they quoted that verse wrong. Yeah. And, but to have that grace with everyone, yeah. including your husband. <laughs> yeah. But I think it's especially your husband, isn't it? Oh, possibly. <laughs> but it's, yeah, to just forgiveness is just, yeah. just needs to just pour out of you. Yeah. And, and two, like when you walk up to somebody and you're approaching them, no matter like what the, whatever has happened or, you know, big, small, whatever. You know, you walk up to them and you talk to them and you say, I'm sorry for. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Not, you mm-hmm. don't say, you know, like, well, you know, like a if you yeah. did something. Mm-hmm. Yeah. You did. Mm-hmm. And yeah. that's just something that the Holy Spirit has taught me. Yeah. You take responsibility for whatever. Mm-hmm. Because he's showing that to you. Right. You know, that you own, mm. you just own it. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. And because, you know, you you don't let the other person own right. whatever God's showing you. Right. Yeah. You take it That's off good. their right. plate. Right. right. That's yeah. good. Just like Jesus took everything off our right. plate. You know, yeah. you take it off theirs. Mm-hmm. And that's just what he sh- has shown me. Mm-hmm. That, you know? That's good because yeah. when you put it yeah. on them, yeah. then it's at that moment, they're receiving an offense. Mm-hmm. Still. Yeah. You're still yeah. dumping something yeah. on them. Yeah. Because yeah. okay, then, yeah. then they feel like it's they've. Right. Right. I created it. Up. Yeah. Like, well, okay, you mm-hmm. still owe me something or aren't you going to say something to me because I'm giving you this. Mm-hmm. So I'm waiting for. Your portion, right. but yeah, th- if it's really true, I'm sorry. Yeah, I am yeah. sorry because you know they don't owe you anything mm-hmm. because you are giving you are mm-hmm. you know, and that's just that's just what the Lord shows me because you want to restore. Yeah. What yeah. was law? Yeah. Right. Because that person is more precious mm. than yeah. your <laughs> ego. Yeah. Right. Yeah. yeah. Than your <laughs> right. You know, being right. Mm-hmm. Than yeah. Y- your division and your you know whatever it might be. Mm-hmm. And so you want wholeness. Yeah. And mm. and th- right. you know that's just because it. It grieves mm. your spirit yeah. mm-hmm. to have any, any, ugh. yeah, you know, and people are going th- and, and two people are going through seasons in their lives mm. where, you know, the enemy is really giving them vain imaginings, mm-hmm. yeah. you know, like young mothers, you know, people, older people and. Um, just all kinds of different things and they get, you know, upset over things mm-hmm. easier and, you know, and all kinds of stuff. So you never know what's going on. Mm-hmm. And so, you know, people get upset easier at different times in their lives. Right. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Um, and so it might be harder for them to, you know, walk up and be like, I'm sorry. Yeah. And, yeah. You know, and I think at least that's what come to me sitting here that it, you know, sometimes yeah. it might not be as well, easy. For nobody some likes conflict. To, yeah. Because I mean, it's not, yeah. not something that yeah. you're going to step into eagerly. Yeah. Like, okay, right. now we're ready. Yeah. Uh, but but the Lord just gave me the word harmony. Yeah. And I mean, that just, yeah, we, we want that flow. We want everybody to, yeah. to be moving in the same direction and there not to be mm-hmm. any discourse or turmoil yeah. and. And it, it, it can be such, it can be humbling when you're in a situation yeah. and you're like, oh, I messed up.